All right, so we want to figure out 1 divided by 3, what do we end up with? So we could just write 1 divided by 3 as a fraction. It's 1 third, 1 over 3, and that's one way to do it. If we want to get this as a decimal, though, we're going to have to take 1 divided by 3. So we take 1, and we want to see how many times 3 goes into 1. It doesn't go into 1, so let's put a 0 and a decimal point up here. Then we can make this 10. 3 times 3, that's 9. Subtract, and we get 1. Doesn't go into 1. Let's move over one space. Call this 10. Well, 3 times 3 is 9. If we subtract, we get 1. Doesn't go into 1, but if we call that 10 and move over 1, 3 times 3, and you get the point, right? We just keep going. 0 0.333 and so on. So we can write that 0 0.3 put this bar over it to show that the number repeats. Or you could just write 0 0.333 for quite a while. Either way, when you divide 1 by 3, it's 1 third as a fraction. It's a decimal, it's 0 0.3, and that 3, it keeps repeating. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.